Hey guys, today is me, Sparky Mods here, and today I'm going to show you the top 10 best weapons you should buy in Pixel Gun 3D. It's going to go from 10 to bad to 1, the best. So it's going to go down that order. So number 10, the Storm Hammer. The Storm Hammer now arranges from 700 coins to 900 coins at some times. And it's just a really noobish weapon that you don't have to put too much skill into. And it's a great weapon to have. They did nerf it, so I think it's overall a really nice weapon to you have in your arsenal. So, second one, Prototype. This goes for 225 coins, and it is an OP beast at low levels. It's only 220 coins, and you start off with about 50, and then you spend 10 for 40. It's an OP beast that can shoot through walls, has a full time zoom, wall break, and is just really good until level 12 until you, you know, buff it up again. Number 8 The Minigun shot, Shotgun. Now, this gun ranges from around 300 coins, it normally changes. Um, it's a legendary shotgun that has automatic and it's shotgun as you can see it is really fast and it's just really easy to use number seven dead star now why i suggest dead star is because it's a really cheap weapon only costing 190 coins and it's really good in general for most skilled players number six elder force saber while this saber lets you move around a lot it's also really good as well I'll leave a link to my video where I showcase the Elder Force Saber and the Dark Force Saber. So it will show you how to easily use this in combat. Number 5, Champion Solar Cannon. I know this should be high, higher up in my list, but I really put it here because now they nerfed it and it's a two shot. It's a really spammy weapon, easy to use, but I don't really find it appealing to most players as it's 170 gems. And also, the Elder Force Saber ranges from 245 coins and around that maybe 145. I lost count. Number four, the Bastiodon. I know most people don't see this on the lists anymore, but I still think it's a decent weapon. It's really good at block slash and it has a looping and an area damage hit. It's really good for level 36 players or 32 and people that have just leveled up to 27 to get a skill and get to defeat all the higher ranked players. Number 3, Combat Yo-Yo. It was nerfed a little bit recently but it is still the most OP thing in the basket. As well, the Bastion is 190 gems and ranging around that. Combat Yo-Yo, 250 coins and around that. I, I'm not really sure, but I know it's coins. This is a really OP weapon that shoots out like no other melee. It shoots out with a really powerful spinning attack and it demolishes enemies really quickly. Number 2, Thunderer. As the Thunderer is still really quick and easy to move with, it's also really quick and easy to shoot and really powerful. It's a 2 times zoom, single shot and a wall break. It's a really nice weapon to move around with and you feel really comfortable while using it. It ranges to about 170 gems and round that. Number 1. Anti-Champion Rifle. I know most people wouldn't really like this weapon as it is a sniper, but this really does help you get the skill to face higher level players, and it is really good anyway. It ranges from 170 gems and it really is worth the buy. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this tips video. And leave in the comment section below what other things i should do on pixel like top 10 weapons you shouldn't buy or something that you want to see leave the comment in the comment section below and i'll leave the vi the video where i use the elder force saber and all for now that's it peace out guys